Alright, hi. <clears throat> Welcome back to the Forge of Fiesta and more Barrier Tower. Last time I got to Barrier Tower after fighting Greg and then we uh, got a box or two and now we're moving on. And uh, yeah, I still don't like my odds necessarily, but it is what it is. Hoping I gain a level here. Also hoping nothing does level 5 death after me gaining a level here. That's me's problem for later, though. I am gonna have to make sure I'm not a multiple of five before, like, you know, a while. But, you know, again, later me's problem. Kill it! Dang. Also, dang, nice rolling a zero there. But, uh,. That helps. If, if you're done wasting turns doing nothing, I'm gonna go ahead and do something. That's just what I'm gonna do. Something. And, uh, yeah. So, yeah, the boss here is a thing. I can get I'll take it. Oh, good. I love missing. That's just what I like to do there. That's a good use of my time and skills and effort and everything. Good, 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 good. I like. There we go. I don't care if that one hurt. That's fine. I don't think anything super dangerous can do level 5 death on me right at the moment. But, uh, yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna get rid of you first, even though you are technically more dangerous. Pronoun game. Kill it! Oh. I'll take Matt and go, though. Yeah, don't care. If I'm gonna start missing attacks and not getting kill procs, I just can't be bothered. I gotta power up the chicken knife anyway. Because the chicken knife is superior to the brave blade. Anyway, 18,000 gil later. Seventh floor. I'm gonna go up a thing. Okay, I want to kill that reflect knight in the hopes that I, it drops a thing. I probably should like actually use a thing, but I think that's good for right now. I want to kill that reflect knight though. Ba -da -ba -da -ba -da. I'm gonna just aim at that magnet. Magnetite. Because that. And also this. This is just a wombo combo of things that if that Reflect Knight gets an attack off now, uh, could kill Ferris. So. Magnetites are really, really annoying enemies for that reason, as is the effect of just. I'm gonna pull your back row characters to the front row, lol. That's sad. Evasion is still a good thing. Let's see if I can get a kill. Yes. Okay, good. Oh, good. Let's paralyze you while we're at it. Because I don't know if it's a drop or a steal, but Reflect Knights can potentially give me Reflect Rings, of which I eventually want four. If I can get one now, that would be stellar, dandy, happy-go-lucky fun times. Normal Squirrel. We had a flying one earlier. Probably should have jumped in hindsight. There we go. No reflecting. That's fine. I know I want to fight those things. I don't know if it's a steal or a drop. If it's a steal, I'm kind of not in a happy spot. Also, this is your captain speaking. Uh, today we're going to be down in a barrier tower. I moved 10 steps and now fighting a goblin. Also, over and out for some reason. Also, zap. Is that likes lightning magic? So in all those floors we crawled, he got down like a flight of stairs. That's uh, good job, buddy. So before I open the next set of boxes, I am gonna hit a save point. Okay, ninth floor, this could go either way. That is a monster in a box. I want to hit the save point first. And I haven't really spent MP, so I'm not gonna bother tenting. I'm just gonna save. And back, I should, 
I should actually just reset there because it's like I took three steps out of the save point. There's just a little, uh, not fun there video game. Anyway, speaking of not fun there video game. Two yellow dragons. Let's see. Let's give it the old college try. Lightning. That hurts a lot. Bees. Yeah. I might die. This might take a minute. This is why I wanted to save first. Sometimes you get one red dragon, sometimes one yellow dragon, sometimes two yellow dragons. Oh, goody, I rolled a zero. Lightning. Nightingale. Oh, good. Yeah, squirrel things. Squirrel can take down a dragon. Oops, not kick that. I'm still gonna go for the nightingale. Bees, okay, thank you. I'm just gonna reset. I don't want to fight two yellow dragons if I can avoid it. I know it's better EXP, but I, uh, yeah. Not getting Nightingale there is probably going to cost me a lot in the future. Hey, look, I made it more than three steps this time. Thank you, video game. Okay, it's just a red dragon this time. That can be mercifully one shot if I'm lucky. Wasn't this time, but you know, it can happen. Bees, that's of all the times to not get Nightingale. I get it when I didn't need it, now that I needed it. Don't hit Ferris, that's all I ask. Or die, that that's a good second. Okay, that works too. I think you have like several thousand HP, so I'm just gonna go for a traditional normal cure. I could have in the yellow dragon part rezzed Barts. I could have. But um Lightning would have followed, it would have been another res. It would have just been a chain of Barts is just dead and I didn't want him to miss out on the XP. So ba -da -ba -da -ba -da. Actually let's try for the nightingale. There we go. That's good. Ba -da -ba -da -ba -da. I know Red Dragon has a really, really nasty, like, really devastating fire move that it's somehow not using. So if it could just that atomic ray. Nightingale, need it. Yes. Okay. Okay. Flat out killed it this time. And gold hairpin. So yeah, bit weaker in pretty much every regard, but half MPU. So yeah, I'm gonna do that. Now let's go back to the save point. Hoping to god that a random counter doesn't just like back attack white me or something. But yeah, looks like we're good. So, like, really expensive spells, I can now just kind of spam. And considering my most expensive spell forever is going to be one of the Raws, then, uh, yeah, I'm in decent shape. Okay. Let's do a save and be on our way. That was the last treasure, by the way. That was it. This is the boss. And, uh, I'm going to break rods here. I'm going to break probably three total, considering how far I am. No! Uh, no. 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 Okay, thank you. No. Yeah, let's let's pull a red mage into a front row with two gigases. That's what I want to do right now. Oh, wait. Yeah, you weren't attacked. Okay, everyone's healed up. Everybody's good. So, this boss has a peculiar gimmick. In that, pretty much one of my characters is going to be dead at all times, and then it's a Zerg Rush. And, uh, yeah, I pretty much want it to not... I don't know who I want it to be. Not Gallif, I think, does the most damage. And not Lena. I think everything else would be fine, though. So yeah, this boss can be that one boss on a casual run. And with my setup, considering I don't have a whole lot of high output, is uh, also probably going to be that one boss. I'm going to break probably three rods, one of each, and uh, hope from there. 
uh, having rapid fire here would have been really nice. Because in all honesty, I would have made Ferris Monk and Bart's Ranger, which is probably what I'm going to do. And then uh, go from there. So yeah, Atomos opens up with Comet. That can kill multiple people. And no, I'm not letting it be Lena. The problem is when you revive someone, does it again, that can hit multiple people. Or just spam cast it. Yeah. You're gonna jump. I need damage going out. I need Lena not dead. I'm just throwing them out there. I need Lena specifically not dead. Wow. Okay, this boss is just absolutely being a, a jerk right now. I am gonna run out of... Oops, did not want to animals. I wanted to aim for. I'm gonna have uh, Bart's do a hard race. So here's the thing. When someone is KO'd, they're gradually being pulled in. And if they get pulled in completely, it's just, like, vanish, essentially. Hearts or Ferris! Thank you! All of my hate. All of my hate right now. I can let her stay on the ground for a minute, but I need her up to break Rod's video game. Hearts or Ferris! Thank you. Thank you. There we go. Blaze it. You know what? I know what my first break is going to be. Okay, let's see Gosh. I'm gonna break a fire rod. I know it's called flame rod, but I don't care. I'm breaking a fire rod. You're going back to potato. I don't even know. Okay, so that that's good. Then Lena can stay on the ground. When Bart's gets closer, I'll have her res him and hope for the best. Galif is obviously not a candidate for staying on the floor. Uh, this, this boss should chill, probably. I think I'm pretty good on rod breaking at this point. Honestly, I think Ferris is the best candidate if I have to start over to uh, stay on the floor. Gravity, that's whatever. Thunder Rod. Actually, Lena can stay on the ground at this point, probably. I'm gonna get him up. I should have had Gallop jump first in case he was the one hit. Okay, perfect. Perfect, perfect. Less perfect. Actually, still perfect. We're good. Good, good, good. So you notice how Bart's is still pretty close up there? Yeah. That's a thing. Um, I'm gonna go with Flame Rod. I'm not gonna break this one. I am going to cast Fear, though. Uh, HP otherwise doesn't matter. The boss doesn't attack outside of Comet. Hey, I'm like super front row. Can this do like 6,000 damage or something? That'd be great, thanks. Okay, the boss shouldn't have that much more, I'm hoping. 413. Alright, Blind Prophets, help me out here. She gets a little bit closer, like another turn or two. I'm playing it kind of close. I kind of want to break another rod, but I know where I'm going to need, like, all of them, so... Gravity is whatever, doesn't actually kill. Okay, just like Lemon Break or something? Be cool. Okay, this turn Lena's gonna cast, her next turn she's gonna revive Ferris, and we're gonna break. I probably could get away with breaking another rod. I'm not gonna do all of them, but this is still going to be a thing. Still gonna be a thing. Yeah, Lena's gonna revive at this point. Um, she's actually, ironically, the best candidate for commenting now. Okay, that's whatever. As long as you don't cast a second one, we're okay. That's not ideal, but I'll live with it. Okay, we're gonna Fira. One more turn, and then she's going to bring him back up, hopefully with herself going down this time. Is 
because I spent so much time rezzing people, my damage output is not that high. I should break another set of rods. Lena. No. Double no. Okay, this is okay, but Lena's gonna have to revive. Lena. 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 I was ready. Lena. Gallop being down for a turn also wouldn't be the end of the world. Not both. Oh my god. Okay, so I'm gonna get Gallop up. And that's why this can turn into that one boss really quick. If party members actually start disappearing, that's when it becomes a problem. I know this is bad for whoever stays down at the end, uh, ABP-wise, but... Oh, that's not gonna matter in the long run. In the grand scheme of things, that's not gonna matter. This boss doesn't give you XP as far as I remember no boss does. Sloga is very bad. Very, 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 very bad. I forgot you could do that. I'm gonna get Lena up and start breaking Ross again. Nope, okay, good. Oh. With both of them slowed, it was bad. Oh. Alright, victory, 12 AP. That, that kind of sucks for Lena, but whatever. Like, uh, when I do endgame grinding, it's not gonna matter. <sighs> Love this pop stand, quite literally. It doesn't sell pop, though, because it's pronounced soda. Oh no, lightning has barred the entry. Wind Drake! Yeah, we don't have time to get down there in time, so we gotta we gotta make our escape. Sister hug jump Levi!
on the bright side, we, we have a submarine now. Yay. Yay, submarine. Um, I'll go into more of the specifics about the submarine and everything else later. But, uh, Atomos was relatively painless, and for that I am grateful. Uh, I only need to break, like, three rods, which is pretty nice. Um, I should have broken more, though. If I if I'd had to do the fight again, I probably would have broken one or two more. I'm just trying to conserve for a, one nasty boss way later. Okay, I'm going to break. Well, relatively, I think-ish. Oh, there it is. Okay, cool. Because I wanted to save. I wanted to save pretty bad. Yeah. I'm going to heal between episodes. Don't worry. But yeah, that'll do it for now. Next time, we're going to go on submarine adventures. Uh, yeah, submarine adventures and nothing else. Ha have a wonderful evening. Everybody, love your faces and peace.